to it. Hey there, hello there, hello there, it's Jeff Kerr Dabby, welcome you to this match between the 1948 Boston Bears and the 1905 Philadelphia A's. As you see here, um, Chief Bender versus Willard and Swan, both really not doing so well in this season. So the 48 Braves are ready to go, and they have Earl Tolgerson at first, Sibby Sisti at second, Bill Elliott, Bob Elliott, sorry, at third, Jeff Heath in left, Danny Litweiler DHs, uh, Pat Burr as a catcher, Eddie Stanky shortstop, Conister at center, and Moose McCormick in right field. In the meantime, the 1905 Phillies have Danny Hoffman at center, Sox Sazewell in right field, Curry Davis DHs, Jim Gentile will play first base, Harris will play left field, Lavi Cross at third, Danny Murphy at second, Monty Cross at short, and Jim Gonder at catcher. Now, of course, as we all know, the 1905 A's were told they needed some players, so they took some leftover players. By the way, team stats, the Boston Braves 12 and 28, the Philly A's 14 26, and both, I think, are in the same division, right? Mm -hmm. So they're, they're in the AL East, I believe, right? Yeah. So I don't know who the Boston Braves lost to. Lost the player who they lost, but it doesn't matter. The one and nine and lost ten, so easy pickings for the shy team. And on the road, forget it for the Braves. They're four and fifteen. The Philly A's, on the other hand, I'm surprised they're doing decently. Well, they're five and five in their last ten. They're four and two in next remaining games, and they're doing better at home than on the road. The Boston Braves. I've only stolen three stolen bases, 186 for blocks, so they've taken a ton of blocks and have struck out decently. The Philly A's, on the other hand, second in stolen bases of 83. They steal the fleas, if you will. Otherwise, they have not really been hitting that well. And the pitching, forget about it. They're worse in the inning in the American League bullpen, ERA, BAP, and deficient efficiency. There are six in home runs allowed. They've only got a 20. The Boston Braves, on the other hand, have really done badly too. Their worst is 36 in per run average. So it might be a hitter's duel, if you will. So we'll see. This is the last time you'll see these two teams playing on JTV because, well, they've done a home and a road game, but they'll be at the special in, in case of an emergency. So we're at Shy Park. At 3 Eastern Time, so at least the 48 Braves have lost 8 in a row. So Chief Bender will come up. It's Earl Togeson. Togeson to left field. Did he catch the ball? Harris did. See the nice left field stand, double decker? Here's Sisty. Sisty grand ball 5 3. Ooh, slow bouncer and cross. Helps on to it. Start moves. And now here's Bob Elliott. And he's well off. Yep, you see that right field wall, you know, the big wall to make sure that people across the street can't watch the game for free. First and second for Jeffy, Canadian. And ball four. <coughs> so the bases are loaded. And here comes Whitliler. Whitliler drops it in. Well, scored one for sure, and it's just one. So Lentweiler with an RBI, and here comes Paul Burris. Burris to right field, hook, and no way. They didn't go after it. Let's see what Stanky does. Stanky, base hit, the center. Makes it 2 nothing. so that works. And here comes Conister. On the third, right to the shortstop. The Braves do pick up two runs, so that's huge. Warren spawns one and five, but don't be so sure. He might be fine. Here's Hoffman. Hoffman to right field, caught by McCormick. Here comes Sox. Sable, right to right field. Oh, that's off the wall. He's going for two. Why? I'm surprised they didn't just do it, but Sable got his 10th double. 
So now here comes Barry Davis. Davis to center. Nice catch. Going to third base and getting there is Sable. So he's on third and here comes Jim Gentile. He picked, picked up from the Oriole system. We didn't need him, so he's going to come in and get a base hit. RBI single, his first RBI with the club. There's 2-1, and here comes Joe Harris. Another pickup, I believe, Harris. And that's gone! Home run by Joe Harris. I believe he was part of the 19 the Boston Braves. I think they let him go, and Harris just went deep. Get a 3 2 for your shite. Thank you. I want to know if he was the guy. Where's Drew from? Oh, it was Boston. So Boston got rid of him. Here's Lab Lacrosse. So Boston got rid of Joe Harris. So they said for McCormick. Or cross. Abby Cross. And here comes Murphy. Danny Murphy right to the third baseman. So Shy picks up some runs with that home run by Joe Harris. I guess he was the guy. But anyway, here's McCormick. Round ball 6 3. You bet. Here comes Chief um, Turkison. And Bellong. Assisting now. So let's take your ball, 5 4 3. Yes. So double play. Murphy does the job. 3 2 still, and here comes Cross. Monty Cross, that is. Cross right down the line, base hit. It's going into the corner. Monty Cross is going to go double. And here comes Gonder. He was also picked, he was picked up. In an expansion. So Gonder safe. That's his 10 stolen base. Run right there. Gonder has a chance. He's two for eight this year. Gonder will get a base hit and get an RBI out of it. So he'll get a double. One two. Here comes Hoffman. Back to the top of the order. Dribbler. Gonna have to force a throw by Burris. So I'm just third, one out, and socks. Ready to hit no ball. He's going to go home with it. They got saved both, but the run scores is five to two. And I believe that is gonna be the And I believe that is gonna be the end. Well, it's gonna be Elliot and White will warm up. So I think that's the end of Spawn's adventure. Davis to center, Conister makes the catch. Runs 5-2 for the Philly A's. So here comes Elliot. And Bender keeps walking these days. He's got four walks already. Here's Heath. To left. And looks catchable. It is. So Harris makes the catch. And there comes White Lawler. Grand ball. They got the double play. Man, great job. Double play. Walking up and that's 5 2, and I think that's the end of this day. So it's going to be Ernie White who will come into the game. He's done 16 innings already, but they need him. The Gentile. Gentile, 6 3. And Harris. He went deep. And ball four. So he's on base again. And now he's leaving. Ball four. Now walks. Here comes Murphy. Come up right to the shortstop. And did they double? Oh, Stanky doubles him up. It's five two. After three innings, let's look at the BNN report. Puerto Rico and the Giants are 2 2 and 7. Detroit's going to probably take the Toronto 8 2 and end that winning streak. Toronto Mets a 5 1 in the eight, bottom of the 8. Tampa 5 0 in top 7. Atlanta 11 7 in the top of the 5th. Lots of home runs. 
Minnesota is crushing the Philly, the only Philly 71 in the eighth. Texas is crushing the 94 Indians 71 in the eighth. Baltimore 3 1 in the fifth. We got Boston crushing the 1916 Phillies 5 1 in the fourth. Pittsburgh beating up on the 09 Yankees 5 0 in the third. 1954 Giants 3 1 in the fourth. A few games. Oh, Baltimore's already scored five runs. And Colorado, Washington. And there will be some games going on later on. But Chief Bender will face Alvarez. Got him on the fastball. That is his 19th whip for the year. Here's Yankee. Yankee going ball. 4 3. Yep. As he's dropping. Now comes here. On the stir, ground ball 4 3. Yep. So Bender is looking good. And the shot team looks good after the pickup of these new players. So now Monty Cross gets her anyway. Here's Cross. Monty Cross to center and caught by Conister. Under. Ground ball 4 3. Yep. And now Hoffman does the top of the order. Ground ball right to the first baseman. Torgerson does it. Nothing doing for the Shives. Here comes McCormick. Pop up. And yep, right to Gentile. Torgerson. Torgerson, ground ball 6 3. Yep. And now Sisky. And ball four. Fifth walk for Chief Bender. And now here's Bob Elliott. And that'll be a ground ball out. So Bender's done his job. Five to two. The Braves scored two in the first inning. But then nothing else. They're safe ball. And ball four. White. He's taking a step to the block. Brendan White. Two innings. He's walked three guys. He might start the bullpen. Davis. Ground ball five for three. Gentile. Gentile the center. Looks pretty deep, but it's caught a boat. Catch a boat. Nothing doing. 5 2. Now we go to the box score. Boston scored two runs already, but they give up five. Ever since the second inning, nothing's come across the board. Harris from the defender looking for his third one of the year. Spawn not doing so well. But White, three innings pitch, he's done pretty well. Bender's at 84 pitches, so maybe they might go with the bullpen. And there's Heath to center field off that wall. And Heath's going to get a double. Nope, it's getting a triple. He has himself a triple, and I think that will probably be the icing of the cake. Well, you got Myers and Black. You don't really have a bullpen. You have no other options. Lentweiler, face it. I really don't. The other Africa guys are closer. We don't want that yet. There's Burris. I was the button misses. Oh boy. Now he bunts. But that's going to turn into one out. They'll get the the sure out. And the Brut. Sankey tells him that's his name. The Brut. First and second. Black is ready. So they're going to use him now. And Conister will be replaced. Yeah. Can we replace him? He might as well. So Conister out and Russell in. So Jim Russell's coming in. Again, probably to bunt. Russell to third pass the third baseman. That's gonna go all the way to the wall. He'll get five four. Russell makes it five to four. And now second and third for McCormick. He just needs to hit it to the outfield. Didn't work. 
Now they'll need a hit to tie the game. And Ferguson. All four. Versus their loader. Sisty. They're off and double out. Up. Blackley. One eight men back, two scores, but it's five to four. Lenny White's done pretty well for himself. So Jim Russell will play center field. Yeah, so Jim Russell will play center field, and Joe Harris is ready to go. I think they will. So it'll be Antononi and Elliott who will warm up in the paint. So they're going to warm those guys up. Harris towards left. And then top by Keith. White's done a pretty good job of handling these guys. Cross. Well, thank you, lunges. And that's a base hit. Danny Murphy's coming to the plate. And a chance for steal. Got him. Burris. That's him two down. There's Murphy. No, no, 6 3. Yeah, so White's done pretty well coming out of the bullpen. But I think he's gassed. Here comes Bob Elliott. And on ball 6 3. And here comes Heat. And ball 4. Coming right on base for Whitlyler. And ball four. Luckily, can't do anything. First and second. For Paul Burris. So for three. Burris to right field. And Scott. I say built. Two down. Now here comes Stanky. And ball four. So the bases are loaded. And he's got Jim Russell. He can get out of this. Russo, base it. Looking for two. They've got to. Russell, who's been putting on a clinic. He came on. Danny Hoffman. Oh, and they will have to take him out of the game. So it's 6 5. Hoffman is hurt. So now Bruce Lord has to come out of the game. Bruce Lord will play center field. Oh, well, they're going to need him. 6 to 5. Travis Blackley can't do his luck. First and second for McCormick. And Blackley missed again. His fifth walk of the day. I get the bullpen up. We got Henley and Myers. Well, you gotta use those guys. Your setup guy. Two outs and Earl Torgerson. Yep. So Myers will come to the game. To face Torgerson. 19 year No, no. Easy play. No. Murphy makes a mistake. Torgerson makes it 7 5 himself. Here's Sisti. This is to left field and hot. Chief Bender must be mad because he had a win in the bank. Now time to rise to your feet. It's the seven trench. That's not how it goes. Some games have finished and some games are done. Seven to five, Boston, Rooney White, and I think you're safe. Danny Antonelli. So they are going to go with Antonelli. I think that's a smart move for Boston because, I mean, guys, the other guys run four innings. You have a two run lead, so you might as well see what Antonelli can do. I think he's going to be okay. Don't you? I think so too. With a 2 0 mark. And Tanelli. He's proven himself in real life to be a good pitcher. Here's Bryce. 
and Antonelli sets them down in order. One, two, three, seven to five. Well, the Phillies haven't scored since the second inning, so what can I say? And a base hit for Elliott. And he. He. The center catch it ball. Yes. What wild there? How about five for three? You betcha. And he did it. Seven five. And finale will come in and they're not worried up their guy yet. I know they want to go for the closer, but I think they'll wait till the top of the night to warm him up. Here's Harry Davis. Seven five. Davis. That's to right field. Oh, that's off the wall. And there'll be a double. Yeah. Harry Davis. And Dan Gentile. Gentile, ground ball to the wrong side of the infield. It goes to the right side of the infield, the runner will hit the third. But no. And now Joe Harris. Harris down the line, I'll make it 7 6 for sure. Yep. So now you are going to be worried. Yeah. 7 6. Lovely Cross is coming to the plate, and I think you got to warm. Hogue, you gotta warm up your closer, which is Hogue, and Glenn Elliott will warm up too, so. Every cross. Two for two. Well, that's how little field line. This will tie the game. And Lively Cross makes it 7-7. Seven, seven. It's a tie game. Now, Doug Henley. And poor Jayla. Now you got Danny Murphy's 0 for 3. And it will be. I think it has to be um, Ray Sanders. Yep, it's Ray Sanders. It has to be because you got an injured player. Mr. Sanders. To right, that drops in. Will they go for the lead run? They will. Safe. And Antonelli had a 7 5 lead. Sanders makes it 8 7. And I believe that would be the end of that. So, Antonelli had a chance. Monte Cross is going to come in, and no. They're going to say no. John Knight, the shortstop. I think he was that one of those free agency pickups. No, he wasn't. So, John Knight is going to come in. And Knight to right field to base hit. He's got a double, so second and third. Oof, eight seven. Well, Henley's the closer, and now here's Steiner. And both Lord loads the bases. Oof. First Lord's coming into the game. No the ball. They got Hillary. They did. Sissy. Oh, he's there. Three runs make the 8-7. What a wild game we have, and I believe that's going to be Ray Sanders winning the shortstop, right? Yeah. So, Sanders at second, John Knight will play shortstop, and I believe that Joe Myers, I think they're going to worry about Henley. Only oh, Burris is over four, and Boss is going to make a change. Make the change, and Phil Massey will have to come in. Yep, the, the main guy, Phil Massey, will have to come in. Joe Myers, they're going to let him. They're going to let him pitch to Massey. Massey to center field, caught. Where's Sankey? Nine ball, 6-3. Yes. 8-7. I'm going to throw the closer in now. And Jim Russ is coming in. So Henley's one for one in safe situations. He's the de facto closer. And ball four. Oof. Mistake. Mike McCormick's 0 for 3. They will yank him, right? Yes, they will. 
coming homes. There's only one choice, and that's coming homes. It's been an old sign. So they'll need to do it. And throw it. They do. And he's out. And the Braves lose again. Eight to seven. They thought they were losing streak would end. Can you believe it? That's another loss. That's their ninth in a row. They thought they had it. That was a crazy game. No team scored. Every time a team scored a run, it was multiple runs. The Boston Braves scored two in the first, two in the sixth, three in the seventh for seven runs. The Philly A's, three in the first, two in the second, three in the eighth. So it was wild. It was a roller coaster. Up and down and all that. So the Lions were lots of work off the bench, especially by the Philly A's. Harris went deep. So Spawn did terribly white, picked four innings, and then they said, well, let the Antonelli come in. Big mistake. He blew it for three runs. Elliott got the last out. Fender with the five and a third inning. Then Blackley came in. They called it a blown save. I don't know why. But Myers with the win. Not giving up a run. That's great. And Henley his second save. Danny Hoffman was injured while throwing the ball. So Chris Lord had to come in the game. I forgot about that. There was a defensive replacement. C1 Gonzalez and Brett Boone with star moments. And John Olerud is the third star. Anyway, here are your scores. Puerto Rico took down the 1905 Giants 3-2. Ayala beat Bartley with Aishin to save. First game of the doubleheader for the Blue Jays. They lose 8-3. Scherzer beats Wells. The Rays win in Washington 5-0. Price beats Johnson. Malta Johnson, that is. Texas wins at home 8-1 to one over the Night Bright Indians. Huh beats Maliki. Um, Minnesota, the Twins face the 08. Phillies win 7-1. Walter Johnson, 6-1. He beats Myers. Brent Myers. Red Sox crush the 1916 Phillies 13-1. Cy Young beats Pete Alexander. The 1905 beating the 48 Braves, of course. You saw that game live, and it was a close one. Myers beats Antonelli Henry with a save. We don't know who will play tomorrow on the, the future game on JTV, but we'll see. Orioles to beat the 91 Twins 4-1. Palmer beats Tappany with Ryan to save. The Indians with the big win over Houston. McDowell beats Scott Mesa to save. Ed Walsh with a one-hitter against the 84 Padres. Pretty good, eh? Edmonds, two home runs for the Angels beating the 6-2 Giants. Tanana, 8-0. Oh, wow. Brian Tanana. Marshall lost press ball save. The 94 Expos win in the bottom of the ninth. Next to Randy Milligan's home run. Facero beats Black. Yankees with the 7-4 win over the 85 Royals. Gossage beats Black. Mo Rivera the save. Tigers win another of the doubleheader. Winning both games the doubleheader. Lolich beats Hankin. Morris the save. The 1969 Expos win 5-4 over the 80 Astros. Jaster beats Richard. Billy him the save. Kansas City wins 6-3 over the 97 Marlins. Saber Hankin beats Brown. Prince Marion to save. Texas wins the second game of the double header against the 94 Indians, so they sweep. Rogers beat Naples. The 1959 Dodgers shock everyone by winning 5 1 against the 82 Brewers. Drysdale beats Sladen with Levin to save. A lot of home runs hit. A combined 7 between Oakland and 86 Angels, but Oakland, 2 in the 10th, win 11 9. Eckersley beats Moore. Harding picks up the save. The City Auto Mariners went 6 4 against the 6 4 Cardinals. Sasaki beat Sean, and there was a rain out between the 60 Pirates and the 61 Yankees. That game might be. I don't know. I'm thinking yes. Oh, but we but the 60 Pirates have already been featured as the road team. When, though? When? Um, they say. It was April 18th against the White Sox. Okay, then we can't do one of those games. Anyway, National League time, please. Sorry about that. Uh, the 1957 Braves win 2 1 against the 85 Blue Jays. Passaro beats Alexander with Matt Van to save. Um, 
the Reds crush 1918, Red Sox 10-4. Vanderbeer beats McCabe 7-0, baby. Uh, the New York Mets beat Brooklyn 5-1. Gooding beats Newcomb. Uh, Philadelphia beats Arlington 8-1. Alexander beats Wilson. Fuck off. Jeez. Sorry about that. Um, some tactical difficulties. I apologize. Ah, the 75 Reds beat San Francisco 2-1. Gullet beats Schmidt. East with the save. Uh oh, that might be a bad tweet. Um, alright. Milwaukee beats Atlanta 12 11. And that was huge. You got Ma Atlanta performance by Matthews, Jones, Giles, and Duffy. Milwaukee, Gorman Thomas with two. Rob Deere with two. Cecil Kruger with one. Ryan Brown with one. So lots of home runs. And they win in the 11th inning. Fingers beats Bullers. Willie Mays gets two home runs for the 54 Giants, wins 7 2 against the Indians of 1920. Antonelli beats Kowalski with one run in the save. The 2009 Yankees get their asses whooped by the Pittsburgh Pirates. Candelaria beats Wang or Wong, however you pronounce it. The 95 India, um, India, ugh, Orioles win over Colorado. Lucina beats Humanus with more of the save. Uh, Washington's got a 11 game winning streak. Man, they are hot. When you're hot, you're hot. They beat the defensive by White Sox. Pedro beats Garcia. 2017 Twins put up not one, but three runs in the top of the 13th to win 7 4 against the 32 Cubs. Rogers beats May with Duffy the save. Um, the Kev Kevin Brown show as Miami beats LA 2 0. Brown beats Koufax. And the 99 Braves beat the 2001 Mariners 12 8. Brad Boone play for both teams. Smoltz beats Abbott. The 2001 A's win 96. Ham beats Rodney. Bradford to save. The Cubs win 94 for Flushing. Sutcliffe beats Mahal. Uh, Fingerbolt beats St. Louis. Shockman win 6 to 5. Collins beats Carpenter. Kruppel to save. Um, the 2004 Red Sox win 5 0. Low beats Mike Grief. The 1919 Black Sox beat Astro City. Schellenbach beats Madden. And finally, the Diamondbacks beat up on the Padres 10 7. That's easy to beat PB with Belverde to save. We'll finish today's action. We'll talk about, I don't know who will get the future game, but we'll see. Minnesota's now the top team in the power rankings. Why is that Washington? Is beyond me. Jason Gion beat Benny Irish this month. Well, I mean, it's their first week. Javi Lopez, National League Player of the Year for the Braves. Gerger's now got a 20-game hitting streak for the Tigers legend. Duke Snyder of the 59 Dodgers. Surprisingly, has a spectacular week, even though his team set well, five home runs. What can you do? And I think that's 